Speaking of, of Mike Johnson, he also made some other news today as he faces his first criticism from the right flank of his party. I have. I have endorsed him wholeheartedly. I'm, I'm all in for President Trump. I, okay, yeah, no, good. I all expect right. he'll be our nominee. Yeah. And, and he's going to win it, and we have to make Biden a one-term president. We have to do that. All right. So Mike Johnson says he's backing uh, Donald Trump. Kevin McCarthy wouldn't go that far. And it comes on a day in which we just talked about he might need more Democrats than Republicans to get him across the finish line. But they want Donald that Trump to be the nominee. No, I know, but 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 that isn't you coincidental. Know it's true, is it? <laughs> See? Like like he knows he's gonna get some grief from the right, so did he come out this morning and use yeah. this as as Everything, oh look, by the way, I'm supporting Donald it's, Trump. I mean he's walking, he's barely just threading the needle. He's right. got a he's walking a tightrope and he has anyone in that position that has has to do the hard work of actually making something happen in Congress is in the unenviable position of having to thread that needle every day. And if you're not smart politically and you don't know how to give everyone what they need that you need to get on board to get what needs to get what done done, you're not going to survive. But is it really that big of a deal? I mean, was any doubt in any of our minds that Mike Johnson wasn't going to endorse Trump or vote for Trump? No, of course I mean, not. I don't think it's, it's, it's obviously it's not that. It's just yeah, that he's trying to shore timing. up. Uh, this this certain group of his, yeah. of his but does his endorsement do that when it's he's a walking Trump acolyte and disciple? Everyone knows that. So one of the questions is: Is that language or that argument? Mm -hmm. Is that what the DNC is going to do? Well, I think Next the year. DNC is going. There's a lot of negative information about Donald Trump, and when the campaign starts, they're going to right. dump on Trump, and it's not them. That's not political rhetoric. That's political reality because. The, the GOP nominee Trump has so many issues. Right. That and yet, isn't in, in isn't many with polls, he's ahead America. of your candidate. Yeah, <laughs> yeah we're so a year out. Uh, he's yeah. Equal, but we'll, well see. he's not getting better. I bring Trump up may not be on the ballot, though, and because I mean, he might be serving a jail term. So that's, uh, a, that's, actually, a, that's a real issue. Actually, being a convicted felon, would, were that to occur, no, does it, not prevent people from running for I office. said incarcerated. You can't be, you can't uh, yeah, run you know, and be incarcerated I, I, I don't at the same think, time. I think we're gonna. I don't yeah, think that's, Democrats that's are independent. By the way, well, one of one of the reasons why I asked you that question <laughs> is because coming up, we're gonna speak with the head of the DNC, Jamie Harrison, and ask him just that. What we saw out of Mike Johnson today is that sort of gonna be the tack, the pivot. Is that what you're gonna make, Jamie Harrison, head of the DNC, coming up? Thank you for watching, and make sure you go to joinnn.com to find News Nation on your television provider. And don't forget to click the red subscribe button below to get more of News Nation's fact-driven, unbiased coverage.